Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Audio Tips. Uh, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys a quick and brief lesson. Uh, it's important, actually. It's called uh, how to get an EQ uh, onto your track or how to find the EQ that's uh, already on on your track. Um, uh, basically, how to make it active and, uh, and, uh, and where to find it. Uh, this is very important because uh, EQ uh, cleans up your track. It takes all the the frequencies that you don't want out out if you know how to if you know what you're doing. I'll teach you guys that in later sessions when I get deeper into uh, these tutorials. But for now, I'm just going to show the beginners and new users how to basically open it. You know, just to get the uh, just to get cracking at it. Basically, a quick cleanup. Um, we're going to go into our control menu, and then we're going to go. Instead of our, our some some of these do have an EQ on them. So let's say this is the audio track that I'm doing. Some software instruments do not have an EQ on them, uh, and there's always a different EQ to use. So it just it just so happens that this has a compressor with an EQ in it. Um, uh, the control for the uh, for an audio track has the compressor and the EQ on it. But if you guys want to go into a different EQ, um, you just hit the EQ. Um, to the right of the controls and it takes you into this one and you can fool around with it do whatever uh, please don't mind what I'm doing I'm not really doing anything I'm gonna show you guys how to EQ later on uh, it's an awesome lesson you guys are really gonna benefit from it but for right now I just want to show you guys let's just add a uh, a software instrument real quick just so I can get get the point across what I was trying to get so I'm now I'm in my software instrument I'm gonna go to controls and see here how it does not have a EQ uh, that's basically what I was trying to get at. So I guess the audio track does have a EQ and controls, but the software instrument tracks don't have an EQ and controls. The EQ is to the right, and uh, that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed this lesson. I hope you guys learned something new, and uh, I hope it benefits you guys in the future. Thank you guys for watching my video, and please subscribe.